hey blue table clients! Crazy wizard hair guy here. I got a Richard Gear thing going on today. Uh, all right, guys, I'm just going to give you a quick studio tour. You may see your thing, you may not see it. Uh, but I uh, just want to thank you. Thank you for your business. And, um, you know, it's what keeps it going. So we got some Asgore here. I'm about to take pictures of these. And this is a lot of models, by the way. This is kind of our forte, you know, is painting up like a zillion basic guys. And uh, these are slightly higher level, uh, but those are getting checked off by the client. These, of course, are the projects that are coming and going. We're working on right around 40 projects right now. And so what you see here, these, this, is, this is the very small slice that is not being worked on actively. Like it's coming in from assembly and going out to painting. Uh, there's at least one project here that just I just need to take the pictures of it. Um, also, um, you remember this tree man painted by Jessica, new painter Jessica. That's important for later. This is a gold dragon that I just painted up really quick. We did some work for WizKids and actually have some of our stuff on their site painted to higher levels. Um, and they sent me this uh, platinum dragon. And, uh, of course, I, I, I heated the wings to kind of make them spread out. Because he has to go in this, like, box. He's in a box. So his wings are, like, really down. And it's not a great look. And, by the way, this is, like, a really quick paint job. Nothing to write home about and I really haven't done much painting so uh, let's just go around the room first off we have this Serastus Atropos Knight and this guy oh man and by the way I'm doing a video just on him and the paintwork on this guy is just ridiculously fantastic so I'm very pleased the interiors done too uh, have this Night Haunts army I am loving them and what I learned from these guys is that the basic guys and then these specialty elites, the sizes are like, these are so much bigger. But on the pictures, you can't tell the difference. They all look kind of the same size, you know. And uh, But look at this black coach. This is ridiculous. And by the way, if you want a better look at these, I'm using my low-quality potato. Um, and... So I am going to make a video of just these to kind of show them off because these models are so cool. And uh, going to be teaching a couple of people how to play Age of Sigmar. And I'm very excited about that. And uh, we're going to give them a spin. Tau bits. I've been working on some Tau stuff. Um, oh, I got a new book. John Truby Presents the Anatomy of a Story. So I'm hoping this is going to help me as a uh, as a dungeon master very excited for that got a couple packages ready to go out i'm actually packing some more over here there's a big one up on the packing station that's going out uh this is actually kind of cleaned up a little cleaned up because we were working on making two converted nurgle demon princes and those guys are going to look absolutely amazing yeah just nothing really to see there guys that everything yeah, I guess that's that's the whole update. Going to get this tiger shark out. Uh, you probably saw the video on that. Oh, but you, what you didn't see was this. Let me just gently put this down here. And I converted up from Hammerhead Railguns the uh, super railguns that this thing has. Has Yes, that's right. Uh, hold on. How am I going to do this? Somehow I have to elevate this figure. Here we go. All right. Here it is. There we go. And, um, yeah, so they just, I have a magnet on there, and they slide in. So whenever you have magnets done, don't just clack them together straight. You gotta, you gotta like, hinge them on or go in from the side. You'll hear, like, a little click. There you go. So that kind of jumped back but I didn't click them on directly. And I did them so they would slide into the slots. And there you go. So he's got like his mega rail guns on there. And that was, that was a fun little conversion. Because when you buy a tiger shark, there's two different versions that you can buy. And there's two different versions in the book. 
And if you buy the basic version, that's not the one with the big guns, you get everything in it, except the two big guns. So we just bought that one and then we converted up the guns. So you, you basically, you just need uh, hammerhead rail guns and a whole lot of different pieces to do it. And of course, hire us just to, just to do it. So yeah, these are just web store orders. Oh, I uh, got some um, Venator jet bikes, uh, excuse me, Virtus Praetor jet bikes. And this is a project where it's just the three jet bikes. A lot of people get to us and they, they just, like they're just trying us out. So uh, we do a lot of like sample projects. Also, um, I have some trades coming in. I have a Bretonian army for classic Warhammer Fantasy, all square bases. Those were discontinued, so Bretonians, guys, Bretonians are super hard to find. It's, it's crazy. And uh, also I have a 40k trade coming in, just, just miscellaneous stuff. Wow, I look really washed out in this light. Like I haven't, haven't been out of the basement for a while, guys. Wild haired and crazy eyed. <laughs> All right, so 40k stuff, uh, just miscellaneous. That'll go on the web store, of course. Um, I have pictures of the Bretonians now. Uh, but that is still on the way, and I have an o uh, Beast Claw army coming, and that's all painted up, and that's for Age of Sigmar. So, got some good stuff on the way. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in, and uh, again, I really, I really appreciate it. And this is just going out to clients. Oh, and last time I sent, uh, I sent the last video, client video. Oh man, I am a wreck. Good thing this is not high definition. Um, <laughs> the last time. I sent out, I sent it out to 33 people and it's gotten 44 views. So I don't know if maybe friends are watching it or maybe people are watching it again, but it's in, the, those numbers are interesting to me. So obviously I should probably keep doing them. All right. Uh, thanks a lot. I'll see you next time.